but I go by H, just for the letter. And I'm from Corny, New York, and I'm taking the portfolio boot camp. My name is Maya, I'm from Phoenix Lawyer High School, or well, Phoenixville, and I'm taking portfolio boot camp. Well, I want to apply to art schools, and I have a lot of pieces, but they're really random. And so I'm trying to get a theme and like some usable pieces, rather than just stuff I like, more stuff that'll benefit me. I need to develop a better portfolio before I go to college because I'd like to be an architectural engineer and I need one for architecture. I have little to no expectations simply because I've only taken art classes like at school and so to be in a situation where I'm taking a class like six hours a day I really didn't know what to expect but I don't like it. Um, I didn't really come in with much expectations. I didn't really know what I was getting myself into. Um, I just heard that it was like pretty intense and that there would be a lot of art and it was pretty serious. Um, it's definitely something new. We stand for six hours with a break in between. But I think because it's so challenging and you're so engaged and you can't just walk away from your piece, you're forced to like become one with your piece and make something that's like, it becomes a part of you. So like, I just did a Gushers wrapper and like, I joke that I can't eat Gushers anymore because the wrapper was so challenging to draw. But like, I don't know, you just become the piece and the piece becomes you. I really enjoyed it so far. I've definitely gotten a lot of pieces out of it, which I was really surprised about, like more than the days that I've been here, so. Um, so I'm pretty happy about that. Um, well, I just finished that Gushers piece, and now we're doing reflective self-portraits, which is like you find a reflective object, and then you look into it, and you draw your reflection in it. But I'm using an iron, like an ironing board iron, so it's kind of rounded, and I'll have like the iron in it. It's, it's cool. I'm currently working on a piece of the inside of a Cheez-Its bag, so it's like tin foil. Um, I'm doing that with charcoal. I have so many unfinished pieces at home and just because I started it and then I stopped liking it as much I'm overdoing it and I start something new and here I have to finish something before I can do something else and it's challenging but it's really rewarding because I already have like six or seven successful usable pieces finished not started. I really like coming in and like be, being able to be in a studio and just work on what I need to work on. It's not something I get to do every day. I like meeting new people. I like people a lot. I've made a lot of friends like from the housing and I've also made friends that like aren't in housing and I just like, I enjoy that. I, I would say like, if you're serious about art, definitely do it. I'm definitely impressed by like the other people here. Um, I was kind of like, one thing that I was expecting was to definitely like not be the best and I'm kind of realizing like everybody has their own style and it's just about, it's like a personal thing.